Audio Jungle. The greeting chiefs in the nation's capital have gathered again to reiterate their commitment to the safety of citizens during and after the general election, saying their priority is to guarantee a credible election for the dividends of democracy. The country's national security advisor, Major General Baba Gana Mugunu, retired, gave their shot when the chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, Professor Mahmoud Yakobu, and his directors paid a cursive call to the NSA in Abuja. He said, Nigerians have nothing to worry about in the forthcoming general election. Hence, there have been adequate brainstorming in security management across sister agencies to meet the set targets. Meanwhile, other security chiefs also lent their voices about preparations and procedures to deliver the constitutional mandates. We know what we have done. We are sure of what we have on the ground. All of us here, who are the managers of securing the electoral process, know our responsibilities, know what we are going to do. We are not in any way in doubt as to what our mission is and what to our end state, what our end state is, but we need to let the entire country know that agents of bad news, harbingers of all kinds of stories abound. We see things on the social media, we hear things on various platforms. If these things are intended to scare people, I want to dispel such illusions. Everybody that is concerned in carrying out his legitimate undertaking, casting his vote, will do so in a secure atmosphere. It is very, very important that Nigerians are not pushed to the limits where they will abandon their number one responsibility <coughs> as citizens. That is the most important one. We ensure that the security for the election is solid and that the INEC chairman along with members of this commission conduct their activities without each. I believe that this meeting today couldn't have come at a better time to look at what we've done thus far, what gaps do exist, and how we can close them. But above all, I'd like to indeed pledge the commitment of members of the armed forces to the entire process. We are aware of the situation in Nigeria. We are prepared to checkmate the activities of those who are going to be adverse parties or those who do not even want the election to take place and also provide a level playing ground for those who are willing to exercise their franchise. On his part, the Commission's Chairman commended the service heads for their commitment and dedication, stressing that they are agents of confidence builders as citizens, we have no cause to regret on election day. I'm confident that these actions will further reassure voters, our personnel, service providers, and stakeholders of their safety during the elections and of a free, fair, and peaceful process. We look forward to a comprehensive plan for the deployment of security personnel, including their various duty posts and contact details. This arrangement has been done in the past and has greatly facilitated rapid response to situations that may arise in the field, either on election day or during the collation of results. We welcome the renewed commitment and assurances of the readiness of the security agencies coming from the National Security Advisor and the heads of the various security agencies to the 2023 general election. 
electoral umpire believes guaranteeing effective security will boost the massive turnout of voters. Thus, the meeting is apt with barely 17 days to the general election. Vincent Okushi, KTV News, Abuja. Audio jump. Audio jump.